Well, unlike the east side, the west side stayed dry for the 4th of July celebrations. People gathered at the El Paso Country Club for quite a fireworks show surrounded by lightning in all directions. This fireworks show is an Upper Valley tradition where people park all around the golf course for a spectacular view. Nature's fireworks in full effect. The east side, a different story tonight. KTSM has issued a weather authority alert, not only for tonight, but also for the next two days. The storms could get very strong and dump quite a bit of rainfall. 98, our official high temperature today. That's plus one over normal, 106, the record 1957. Here are the other high temperatures through the borderland today. 97 Alabagordo, 95 Deming, 98 Juarez, and 95 for Van Horn. A look at the rain totals. <clears throat> Still behind 1.83 for the year. We should be at 2.53 inches. But don't worry, eventually one of these big thunder showers is going to hit the official rain gauge at the airport. And as you can see, it's empty today, which tell the east siders and the people around the spaghetti bowl that we had no rain. 0.14 Watt is 0.02 Las Cruces, 0.85 inches in Van Horn, 0.13 for Deming, and just over a quarter of an inch for Cloudcroft. A look at the satellite radar composite yesterday. Storms were hit or miss because all the moisture was out toward the Arizona New Mexico border. That certainly changed today, and it's aligned with the Rio Grande. So all of this tropical moisture will continue continue to produce thunder showers even late into the night tonight. Look at where the rain's coming down. We saw Tawny live out here on the east side and it is a blanket of rainfall for the northeastern quadrant of the county. Another cell moving into the upper valley that was right over the country club too. So hopefully everybody got home safely before that downpour right there up in Las Cruces. We've had widely scattered storms around town. You've had quite a lightning display, but such a beautiful night for fireworks. This is the structure of your atmosphere. We've got a high pressure zone built up over the southeast, but we will continue to get these little ripple disturbances. That's what's going to enhance the chance of the thunder showers, making them potentially stronger and delivering more rainfall over the next few days. Winds are fairly light, though they will be occasionally gusty as the winds break apart tonight. Temperatures right now 78 at the airport, 72 Alabagordo, 73 Deming. Here come your low temperatures tonight, 69 Alabagordo. 67 Deming and 71 for Juarez. Highs tomorrow, 95 for Alabagordo and Deming, 96 for Juarez tonight. Las Cruces, I don't want to remove that chance of thunder showers. 68 your low temperature tonight. Tomorrow, 95 and more scattered thunder showers with the threat of heavy rainfall. 70 the low temperature at the airport tonight with a continued fresh new round of thunder showers forming. 95 our high for tomorrow with more storms and the threat of heavy rain. Only KTSM gives you nine full days of weather. I'm very concerned about the next several days. Wednesday especially, 90 the high temperature thanks to the cloud cover. Heavy rain threat as well. 95 on Thursday, thunder showers. 99 on Friday with isolated storms. Then just a slight chance Saturday, Sunday, and Monday as high temperatures move back to the low triple digits. Thunder showers return Tuesday and Wednesday. What a great time to be a weather watcher. How do you do it? Take a great pic and email it to us at news at KTSM.com. Sponsored by Gonzalez Heating and Cooling. Happy Independence Day. More KTSM 9 News.